welcome back to Hermitcraft. All right. Well, I have uh, spent the last four or five days, I guess it is, trying to get something done here. And uh, even the off-camera stuff has suffered terribly. And so, I am only now actually getting to the point where I might actually consider thinking that I might get something done. Right, let's just use the slabs. The idea is to prevent water flow from getting out of this and coming back here. Because I want to put that, uh, that dropper in there so that I can feed this thing from this level as well. All right, let's see. All right. Uh, might as well use a silk touch. Dropper over there facing into the shaft. Excellent. Put that back in. All right. Now, remember how to make this thing. Start with a comparator. And sure, why not? Block. A dot here, a dot there, a block here. Block there. A repeater and another dot there. All right. Oh, wait a minute. And I think one more block there. Yep. Excellent. Great, so now all I need to do is get a little bit more bone block. And some more of the white concrete. Well, I'm going to need more than that. But that's okay. Some slabs of stairs of the polished variety. Yeah. 
of both. should serve. And now I can take this out. Pick these up. to get some stone brick to fill that in. I guess I could put a wall back. No, I don't want to do that because I'm going to need some way of feeding this. That was no good. Ugh. Oh boy, yeah, I've been uh, having kind of a rough time of things. There, that's better. What with this catheter at all, it's just so incredibly much not fun. And, uh, yeah, okay, so it's made getting things done difficult, and that's about the most polite way I can put that. All right, so there. Now I have a thing up here on this level where I can throw things into without having to go all the way down to the mine shaft. That's good. All right, getting around to another thing that I've been wanting to get taken care of for a long time. And that has to do with the ceiling over this tree growing area. Let's see. Yeah, all right. All right, that gives me the level I want that to go up to. And let's see. As I'm thinking, I'm going to want to... Oh, wait a minute. Yeah. That might be a little on the ugly side. We'll have to see about that or I could just do it anyway and decide I don't care um, in any event okay I like that and now using glass panes to make the material go farther.
actually get some windows started here. Okay, I'm going to have to do something different when it gets to this uh, building structure. That's kind of becoming painfully obvious. But... This is at least starting to look like something that was done on purpose, which is a good thing overall. Farther do I? Oh, I'm almost there. Good. All right. All right. Now, break this down back off a bit. That's kind of the idea. You see, this doesn't necessarily need to provide window view outwards so much as having light coming in. But over there, that needs to be fixed. And I'm not exactly sure how just yet. But as it is, that's uglified. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's not going to work like that. So... I need some vertical thing here. All right. Ah. That's it. I'm going to need a vertical piece here. At least at this level. Something like that. And just continue it across. And now, from there upwards, just have it go a normal-ish. Which means This line of stairs out here could go. The wall on this side just extends straight up, flat glassless. And now on those two sides, I think what I'm going to have to do is a whole crap load of landscaping to flatten all this stuff out, maybe grass it in or something to make it look somehow better. And let's see, what does it look like in this direction? 
It looks like I started on this a while back anyway. A long while back. Yeah. Okay, so that's something I can work on here. And I'm going to do most of this off camera because this is going to be ugly, boring, and repetitive. And I can uh, take some time every now and then and cut all my trees and so on. Because a log shortage is something I have. <laughs> yeah, so that's at least something of a start. And I'll be working on this between episodes and uh, see if perhaps the catheter will uh, be nice to me and let me actually get away with uh, getting a little bit more stuff done. Which, by the way, if that condition continues through tomorrow, then within a day or so after this episode is finished, there should be an episode two of the Kerbal Space Program Manifest Destiny which should be appearing on a TFC channel near you. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. I am out of here.